On the last day of the School of Law Conference, Dr. Henry Okole, advisor to the Provincial Affairs Department, spoke about the conflicts between the three levels of government. Dr. Okole talked about the issue of instability itself and what he personally sees as a challenge in the political culture that is now being witnessed in Papua New Guinea. Today we see the dominance of the executive arm over the legislature. We see also the challenges to the judiciary. And I suppose because it's been with us for some time, uh, I'm, I don't know how to word it, but it appears as if there's some element of tolerance to it right now, even though we know that the executive itself is uh, very powerful at this point. Dr. Okole believes there has to be some changes as PNG cannot allow the system of government to remain as it is. He said there has to be some checks and balances to be among the three arms of government so that government business is transparent. They should, I believe, consider some of the studies, recommendations that had been uh, uh, done over the years. Dean of the School of Law, Professor Mange Matui, said the two-day conference was an ideal platform for the law students at the university to hear from the founding fathers of the constitution and the senior officers from the legal fraternity discuss the constitution in its various dynamics. The conference ended today. There's a lot of issues that revolve around the constitution. Uh, and I think bringing those people who are responsible for discussing, providing their commentaries on uh, uh, issues relating to the constitution is very, very important because then they come to share ideas and discuss about these issues. And in the process of doing so, students are actually learning. The University of Papua New Guinea will see two more days of conferences tomorrow and on Friday to be hosted by the School of Business Administration on the theme of the era of the LNG. Deli Waigeno, National MTV News.